Hi, I'm Dean Newland. I am CEO and founder of Mission Facilitators, where for 30 years we've helped leaders, teams, and their organizations develop their people, clarify their visions, and execute on their plans. So how do you really inspire somebody? First, we have to take a look at the source of inspiration, which takes place in the human brain. Serotonin is that really feel-good chemical that gets fired when we are in a state of bliss and love and connection with other people. Serotonin is also, when we are experiencing it, wanting to create homeostasis with other people, which means if you are feeling pretty good and you're with somebody who feels really bad, aka their serotonin levels are really low, more likely than not, your good feeling will start to match their bad feeling, which means now you've got that homeostasis that I was talking about. So if you really want to inspire somebody, get your serotonin levels high and stick to it, which means in very practical terms, you have to set the tone and the intention for something that you really want and you really believe is important and stay to that high level sense of purpose and energy and intention around bringing your energy up to a high level. And when you can maintain that, other people will raise up their particular serotonin levels to match yours. So if you really want to create inspiration in other people, you have to start with yourself by setting the intention and creating that high level of engagement and gratitude and appreciation. And then just sit back and watch other people meet your levels.